Yo, what is going on, everybody? I'm not gonna lie, it's been like two months since I last posted a video. And I don't really got a good reason for this, I'm not gonna lie. Loki just got caught up with some school and some uh, some work at the same time. It's been crazy since I left. Bro, I miss so much. I checked the Discord today. That thing's been on lock. General has been on lock in the Discord for like three days, people have said. And I'm just trying to figure out like, what is going on? But nah, from what I could tell, I'm gonna be honest, man. This ain't looking good for Type Soul. Bro, I hopped on today. Man, when I used to be playing, bro, like two months ago, this game was averaging like 40, 50K. Why did I hop on today and this thing got 13K players? The fall off of Type Soul is gonna have to be studied if this keeps up. How are they gonna bring the game back and then let it die again? Now, I'm gonna be honest, there's some allegations going around, okay? There's some allegations regarding Cetro, regarding the man who let this game die the first time. His name's Dave. I don't really know a whole lot about the situation. I heard we might got like a Diddy 1, Diddy 2 type of thing going on here. Everybody's Diddy. Hell, you might be Diddy watching this video right now. So, if you didn't know already, the old lead developer of Type Soul, Mr. Cetro Boomin himself, the man who brought the game back from zero players, has now been fired from type soul why did he get fired you may ask i really don't know to be honest they're not leaking a whole lot of information i'm gonna keep it a buck all i know is that like they kind of like it was all it was all peaceful in type soul you know everything was going good we were getting the weekly updates and then all of a sudden i mean this this is not looking good no more and the things i've seen on tiktok since i left bro they talking about they laced the skill boxes with fentanyl they said they got fent skill boxes in the game now you even come in contact with the skill box you better run the other direction bro man back when i used to be playing this bro i was dropping tutorials on how to get skill boxes now we trying to run away from them? Oh hell nah, bro. But I mean, the worst part about it for me, to be honest, about this whole situation from the, the little knowledge that I've been told about so far, is that the old Type Soul lead developer, owner, whatever you want to call him, Dave, that dude that let the game die the first time is now the main dude in charge. We are cooked. Because bro, Cetro really came in not having developed on the official Type Soul since it died and then bro came in revived the game and now bro's being fired i really just don't understand to be honest from what i could tell there's some allegations about him uh like not paying developers or something but that all honestly seems false i mean uh, there's some videos that you can watch about like cetro and like the whole situation but man i don't know bro i mean this is kind of the only thing i'd be playing on roblox so honestly if type still gets cooked it might be wraps Although I heard that Cetro is actually working on a new game, it sounds like. I'm not 100% sure. But I mean, it kind of sounds like that from uh, the way that people have been talking about it. So hopefully he makes a banger. I'm on Team Cetro in this, honestly. I do not like what they've been doing, bro. I think it's very weird to fire the dude who revived the game. And then also, you know, just like locking down the Discord so no one can like you know say anything about you and all this like i don't know bro to be honest it all kind of seems weird i'm gonna try to make more videos on type soul if it doesn't die within the next week all i know is that this thing was like at three days ago like 50k concurrent players and i looked this morning that thing was on 13k players brother things are not looking good for type soul Yo, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna put that in the video to be honest. I just worked this kid, bruh. Nah, he just popped his, he just popped full res on me and I literally let him hit me down to like, I think it was like two and a half bars and I just whooped him, bruh. I'm including that in the video, bruh. But anyways, y'all, sorry about that little interruption about that dude jumping me, ruining the video. But yeah, I just wanted to drop a little update. You know, I've been gone for like two months. A lot has happened, it sounds like. I got this Hakuda build that I've really been enjoying right now. So I might make some videos on it, you know, just like, you know, just messing with people, fighting on stuff. Just drop comments about what y'all want to see, man. But these videos were doing so well when I last posted them. So I'm hoping we can keep going with that. I'm gonna try to make more videos on it. And yeah, guys, I'll see y'all in the next one.